Now I'm facing the task of making a new in and out feed screw for the Shablin mill. It's of 24 mm diameter and the lead is 3 mm. I'm pretty certain that the mill has been crashed in some way along the way of its work life because this is what was in there and this is not the original. I want to make one with a trapezoidal format. I'm using a carbide insert because this will give me at least a correct profile for the nut and the and the screw matching. So I made some trial efforts. I think that's important because I'm a newbie on this and then I want to make um, well, as little mistakes as possible. However, by now I have crashed one insert, so um, it's a little bit trial and error, but at least I've learned what is important and what is very important is to use a, a steady rest. Uh, this has been really important to get the flex controlled. So what I have here on my lathe is a possibility to run uh, different speeds down to uh, the, all the way down to 20 revolutions and I opted now to 80 a little bit uh, cautious in the start. In addition to this being important it's uh, of course important to have the ends now because the finger on this will touch so that, um, it clears on both ends so and then this tight and uh, take it slow and then also uh, the other most important is the infeed I've used the this is a 30 uh, degree uh, angle so I've set this to 15 and used the compound as infeed my compound is five hundredths of a millimeter and I have only stepped it uh, one uh, line at a time. That means I have an in-depth feed of five hundredths of a millimeter. Because I know it's 24 and then down to, the, um, to 20, it's just two millimeter per side. And this is per side. And I have to take it um, 40 times. So by now I have uh, 10 times in so I have another 30 to go. I take it that slow because I don't want to mess up more. Um, on the uh, When I reach the end here I take the, the cross feed out, stop it and then reverse it. And to reverse it a little bit faster I select um, the um, high ratio back gear is on now and then I can select the high ratio. This will still keep the uh, of course the knot in in, um, in here. So and then I run it in reverse back select slow again now this has been snugged onto the and I'm still not deep enough to alter the dimension on the on the so I needn't set this before I get very close. And then I will go in to where I have my zero mark on the cross slide. There I'll go one only squirt some oil. Low gear, snug, in feed correct, set, everything, okay. Begin close.
now from an old wrangle. Sure that this is tight. Yeah, I should probably do away with that. Zero, and this has been increased one mile, five hundredths each time. And I have set this to zero while on the leaf there. So I'll wait until this gets to zero or so, then I will stop and pull out the cross slide. Zero. Okay, I up the speed a little bit. Now selecting here, high series, reverse it. Tendencies to forget about all these, so there are different factors. And also, now one more, so I have um, some sort of progress plan in again. Zero, and this is very tight on here so everything is try to in beforehand set up correctly and then in one more there oil tight everything yes same there Serious. No serious. One more. In again to zero. There. All clear. One more. 